Oh, it's Flair! Flair is a character I designed just for this purpose of being a character. No, wait. Flair is a more major character. Only has this, primarily so he can do stuff. Otherwise, he's just really doing pretty well, actually. I mean, look at this, he's level 2. But, we are here to play with Buff McGruff. The gruffest and buffliest men of all. I should have given him Big Game Hunter, because they get more experience. Then again, that only works on animals. Similar to uh, Killer Vegan giving you more for killing vegetables. <gasps> ba, ba, da, da. Look at his health, look at his strength, look at his five points of armor delicious. Ooh, this is a crude sword of purest of steel. Nah, nah. Meow, meow, meow. Na da da. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Ra ba bum. Dun, 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 I deny that accusation and counter with a mace! Apply directly to one's face. I don't get this, how does this... Oh, I get it, that's how the siding works. You see, you can go diagonally, but you can also go like this. Like two sideways, then one up, then two sideways. Or three sideways up, three sideways up. As you can see, it doesn't light up these this square because it just doesn't reach that via conventional algorithms. Dark orb. Ooh. Fancy. Ooh, I like that one. I would like to beat someone with that ugly stick. On his ugly mug! Wink, wink. You say that a man with so much burliness would be able to burl his way straight through this. I'm only at half, and I have t I have more health points than a typical mate starts with. Why would I give a shit about healing right now? That being said, dude, look at that. Look at this. Really shows you what a. Remember, this is all nines except for this breastplate stuff. But look, it really shows you how a level up goes together if you make a pure. And it's time for a totally legit cheese. And a tuba. And then digest. Oh, I could convert that to rust. I wouldn't know why, though, but hey. Let's see, I think I'm gonna go with this one, actually. I could use some trap affinity. On top of that, it gives me an extra burliness. Which will make me the burliest of burl. <laughs> Did I already say I'd like to welcome one and welcome all? If I didn't, I'd like to welcome one and welcome all. To Dungeons of Dreadmoor. Well, there is nothing to dread but this man, Burly McBurl, and his burlesome powers of burliness. Buff McGruff, strongest man, I don't... WHOA! Holy fucking shit, man! That is one hell of a bow cross. I would not like to cross that bow! Wink, wink! Let's try it out, shall we, with a... Humble wooden copper bolts. I'm impressed. Can I open this door? Okay. No need to open that door. Uh, I would do it with some trap affinity.
Then I shall eat the smoked cheese. Boom. Uh, cooldowns never get lowered. It's kind of sad because mages get a real big advantage that as they get more powerful, they're able to cast more and faster. That is not a 45% chance, dear sir. Wow, that is really good. I'm right outside a Braxington shop. Wait! I possess the unholy love child or greasy offspring. Do I have any of this? No, I get that later, I guess, from constructs. You can have all the steak and this and this. You can have this. What does this actually give me? Ooh, that's actually pretty good. Probably should have kept the steak. Melee, give Siphon's life, cheese, booze, I don't need booze, I never will need any booze. So truffle's pretty good, that's also pretty nice, just in case I get a really bad debuff, I could use that one. Let's see, have the ingredients. I say why not. Okay, let's see what we can make with my little anvil, my little anvil. Ba something something anvil Wait, I have level two already? Oh yeah, probably because of the Imperial stuff. So where do I get the uh spiky mace that I need to make the um uh, ugly stick with? I know that I don't have the level, I most definitely don't. Very long yeah, that's not a mace. I'm a maceketeer, you know. Wink wink, nudge nudge. I really wish that once in my life the opportunity will arise that I can really just go wink wink nudge nudge. Just legitimately <laughs> look at someone with the dumbest of glazed looks. <laughs> nudge him with my elbow <laughs> and most obnoxiously wink at him in confirmation that yes, I do understand the situation. <laughs> Get it? It's a joke. Wink wink nudge nudge. Don't have the level. Ooh, fancy ask. Broader axe. Is a poly broad, even to the most broad minded Europeans. <laughs> oh, I think this game is worth its money just to read the descriptions of all the items, dude. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, I don't get this. Oh, I could do that. I mean, it's, it's steel, but hey. Maybe it goes one of the other ones. Oh, it, oh shit, so I can't make it. I can't make the ugly stick. It's not a pretty sight, but it gets the job done. Oh, screw you. Okay, what was I? Well, it could make a rough... Ooh, that's actually a pretty fucking spiffin' mace. That, and I can increase it over time, which makes it even better. So you're saying that for level... I guess that other one's level 1? Yeah, that one's level 1. So for one level more, you can get a much more potent one. There's a run-in with a sack of nails. <laughs> like I said. Ooh, I never crafted anything. Oh, it's such a pretty weapon. You can have that mace. Just don't beat yourself with it. Wrong one. Great fun. Ah, 
How about we have a little running with the ugly stick? You mean a sack of nails? <laughs> snort, snort. Ah, snorting. It used to be the man's way of doing things. And then came along the woman. I'm not like that. I'm not a person that endorses sexism. In fact, I don't endorse sexism that much that I deny its existence. You're not hurting me! At all! Your critical hit didn't even hurt me! What the fuck was that guy trying to accomplish? Well, he did piss me off, so I guess he has that. If it isn't a Cronian artifact. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah, it also shows you the other enhancements that are already on it. It showed me one mana. That's because this is already an artifact, and Krong makes it an artifact, so yeah. One transmutative damage. Fuck yeah, bitches. A new style Pilsner. I just like saying that, it's so cute. Ooh, fancy. New style Pilsner. New style being another word for really, really fucking disgusting. I disagree with your tactics. Moisture. Oh, wow! I like that moisturization. I shall never mock a moisturization cream ever again. Aha! He tasted my ugly stick. Or did he? I think he did. Or did he? Yeah, I think he did. Or shut the fuck up. Or and no one ever heard from Bob again. That's not a very good bedtime story, you know. <laughs> and the level has been upped! Oh yeah, this one gave me that extra level. Oh, oh, look at how burly I am. Now with my one trap affinity skill, I can pick up some small traps. Wow, that is a really strong crossbow. And it's another Braxington shop. Wait, 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 wait. You're telling me that the shop ends right before the door? That's kind of creepy, actually. Crappy crossbow, crappy mace, crappy staff, crappy... Crappy... With that brass ring, it's got some nice piercing defenses. That one's actually better than what I have. I mean, transmutation is one thing, but... Given the chance, I put my money on something better. I don't really need brimstone or saltpeter, do I? I can't tinker, I mean, I got some skill. I don't think I need copper. So let's make something out of that too. Oh look, I got some more copper bolts. Some explosives. 
One thing I don't like about this game is that crafting is somewhat difficult to maintain. That is a really crappy mace, and I wouldn't want that for the life of me. All it has is one asphyxiation resistance. Why would I want one asphyxiation resistance? Just one. Two? I'm listening. But one? That's like saying, here's a cookie. You happy yet? And again, I was really just putting a gamp. Ooh, let's try this one. I have to say, I can throw things with the speed of fucking lightning. Hmm, let's try it out then. I forgot you can't target the ground with some of these weapons. Here's my mace. It loves you this much. Hey, man. What the? <gasps> more evidence of Dripmore's foul plan. Also, use a scrap battle. Oh, dear. Ah, an instantaneous access rule to Braxington Brax. I agree. <laughs> mm -hmm. Some say all roads lead to Rome. But is that really true? Or is it something that the aliens are trying to tell us? I think it's pretty true. I mean, Rome was the capital of the Roman Empire, so... Logically, a lot of roads were built to go straight towards it. It's a sense of centralization and patriotism. Or... There is no or. That's the best explanation, if anything. Aliens. Why would aliens have benefit of all roads leading towards Rome? If you can answer me that question, Batman. Rocket Fist. Fuck yeah, Rocket Fist. Sir, are you having a problem? Yes, my rocket just won't fist anymore. Could you please rephrase that in a non-double entendre context? My bajingo won't bajuber. Perfect, just perfect. You can also throw things with just exceptional force that it penetrates the speed of sound and destroys it. Oh, oh. Do I really want this even? I guess I do. Actually, I don't. It's made of shame and disgrace. No, the shame! It cuts through my body like a sharp knife cuts through a butter. Enough of this. I'm going to see how long the recording is, and if not... Hmm, I'm going to go back on a monolith. I forgot where the monolith even was. I think it's right where that guy is at. What the fuck is this? It's good for a warrior, but the, the one I have right now is like way powerful. Yeah, I'm gonna see how long the recording is. If it's not too long, I'll see you guys in a moment. Now, so you know, get one regardless. Meanwhile, I'm gonna hide behind this door. Oh, well, let's go on. I want to show you Flair, but Flair's kind of my guy. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you him when he's interesting. Who? Do I, oh yeah, I was gonna do Judoku, wasn't I? Yeah. We're gonna see how far we can carry her this time. So the rest of this episode is gonna be Judoku. Being Judo. To become one with Judo. To become one with it all. Something. No! These girls are much better. 
stuff your face. Okay, let's organize a bit. Rubber pants, what do I have? I also have rubber pants. But my non-sexual. Let's put on my random I want to get rid of this loot. What does the arcane one even do? I guess nothing. Mmm, bone bolts. I don't have any sword. I'm unarmed. Thieving gloves. I'll keep those around. I'll keep that around. I'll keep that around. I'll keep that around. Loot this can go over here. Okay, Lodvisk, traditional Norwegian fish product, was invented by the Vikings as an easier way of instilling fear in their enemies than raiding or in pillaging. This tradition inflicted upon young Norwegians by their grandparents and is described by one famous Arthur as the world's largest chunk of flim. Fantastic! I don't use any magic, do I? Yeah, I have a couple magic spells, but nothing that really means that I need to gulp down some mana. Really? Oh yeah, that supersonic sword that I can't fucking use because I don't... Supersonic racing, shut up! It's kind of hard to design a character when you're unarmed, when unarmed is basically your entire skill set. Ugh, look at all those sparkles. Sparkle, sparkle! It's so annoying. Okay, what else can I get rid of on the short term? Oh, what, what is my strength buff? 14. Mmm, I guess I could put these bone bolts away for now and this Eldritch Bolt. Put my fine powders over here. Perfect. Get out of here, you. Fuck, what do I do, what do I do? I know, I'll do what countless of us are- I do what countless of generations have done. No, only do works twice. Okay, so now I have really good defenses. I yeah, I'm I'm fucking ready, bro. Fuck, I'm standing in the acid. Let's scoff something down before times get weird. Ah, this aged blue cheese will do just fine. Concussive bomb. Boss. Yeah, that finished him off, didn't it? Trying to remove themselves to outside. 
How the fuck did that even happen? I am berserking out of my mind, bro. Okay, I now have so many buffs that it is literally impossible to... HOLY SHIT! I am summoning a second line of buffs! This is getting out of the way. What the fuck is this even? It's a young carrot. This monster zoo is not very appetizing. I am not enjoying this. Ugh. What does it do something then? Oh, it just creates more fire. Well, I guess that if everything's gonna stand in front of me anyway. It's not a big blue demon. What the fuck are you? Die. Just die. Uh, if I have any booze with me, I'd gladly drink it. And potion of replenishment. Let's do some dire empowerment. Yeah, that'll do just fine. Let's do some potion of stealing. Holy shit, I have armor out of this world. There is a lot of shrouds of darkness going around. I wish I had booze. I knew there would be a day that I would wish that I had booze. Tis the irony of life, I am afraid. Even my mighty foot cannot change that. Well, you've come this far, might as well go in for the finals. This magic shield is not going to last much longer. Yes! 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 Could use some psychokinetic shoving. Or could I? Just what you want to happen. Let's get a seismic uppercut and show them what a true seismologist can do. I do not want to use that attack when there's nothing in front of me. Oh dear god, this is such an overkill. Oh, Tweed! Fuck you, man! Wow! Really?
That's the best you can fucking offer me? I rip my heart and guts out to get through this fucking hellhole. And all I get is a fucking memorial prize. Sir, this curse isn't working. Come on, or oh, whatever. What the fuck is that? Alchemist still, still slack. With potent potables were once. God. Damn it, game. Much alchemy, buck, sardite, brass mechanisms, alchemical ooze, aquaregia. Sludge. All the good stuff's looted. All the few dewy stuff more as remain. Hmm. Well, that's fucking great. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? Look at this just random diggle commando standing everywhere. Eh, stick a booze. No, no, no. You stop bringing things back to life. Jesus. Stop bringing things back to life. Yes, you need an adult to kick your face in. Well, at least I'm getting a lot of experience out of this bullshit. Fucking hell. The Hyperborean damage, some resistances, some armor. My Hyperborean resistance is fine, and I like that extra armor. It's studded with tortured black iron and is decorated with excellent sapphires. I kinda like that damage buff this thing gives me. Look at my buffed damageness. I wonder, does it does something else appear if you get well I think I actually have all resistances possible with this thing. Let's see. These are the melee ones, there's high boring electric. Huh? These are all resistances possible. You think therefore you resist. His best baking soda. Magic rings again. <laughs> and the occasional politician. Oh dear. A strapping frogs to your body. They're thick. Rings again. It refers to another resistance. What the hell? <laughs> if you're a witch, you're likely to be working near witch try to find objects. Caution: as best as armor has been determined by dwarf and mountain gnomes to cause an increase in lung cancer, beard rot, and strange moods. So yeah, piercing with bees. Let's go with a bang. Protection razor burn. <laughs> Blunt objects like bricks. You know, I wouldn't mind a little more sneakiness, because so far everything seems to be detecting me without even looking at me. No, 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 what is this thing? Oh, it's a knobbly staff. Oh, 
Did he just punch at me with his eyes? Cool. If I can get one more level up in this video, I'll probably shit a brick. And then I'll hit myself with it. And with my crush resistance, I shall resist it. Ooh, a new kind of room. The Clockwork Ravenger. The scaly Holbrick of the fish. The Thermite Lance. Ooh, that's fancy. The Clockwork... What the fuck's with this Clockwork, man? Bookshelf, Fistful Blade, Clockwork Ridley, your belt, Nature or Magnetronic Shield. Wow, that sounds fancy. The Galgus Gaze. Some health if I want it, and... Wait, Mud One and Asic? Wow, that's... Really disturbing. The fuck's with all these monsters, man? Ugh, I need a new drink. Let's do some hard cider. Huge crack over right through the middle. Ew. Gross. This place is full of satanic displacement glyphs, it seems. Good if I want to get around, but... And there is a monster. The grandpa mustache, a pinnacle of wisdom and experience in a... This monster's trying to kill you. I wouldn't knock him away, but that would just harm my cause, wouldn't it? I never want to kill a glowy monster if you give him the opportunity, because they give a lot of experience, and you lose experience if you do not directly use it. So you do not keep the experience you get during a level up, so if you have too much of it, you will lose a large chunk. Wow, this guy's still not fucking satisfied? Damn. Top of that, where the fuck's Brax at? Ugh, do I have to kick this aside? I think I do. Hmm, trident. Ooh, that's fancy. Secret Diggle listening points. Commando took a straight hours required listening to the walls. There could be more spying on you even now. There he is. He made me level up. License to kill. Ooh. Oh no! Killing blow. Your next attack is gonna make a real splash. I want that one. Actually. That would be really potent and really destructive, to be honest. Desert skin warlock's challenge. Let's try this one. I mean, I like that cutting resistance. Oh, it's a, it lasts a certain amount of hits. But it also lasts a certain amount of time. Kind of crummy, actually. But it what does it give me, anyway? Oh, wow. That's some pretty fuck. Wow. That's really potent if I need it. Oh, another altar of this guy? Well, I'm going to cut it off here. I'm going to render it all out and put it up on YouTubes. Probably going to play a little bit more with Mr. Flair. For now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did not enjoy this video... You hurt my feelings, and I hate you forever and ever. Please do not come back, do not return to start, do not collect any do gets or whatever the fuck you feel like. Final point is, I do no longer like you. Hey, look, it's Brax. I dislike how little damage I'm dealing. I need more burliness. What you got for sale, Mr. B Ooh, a witch's hat. In the dungeon that can poke your eye out. Ooh, one sparkling glove. Just, <laughs> just one. I got some fancy stuff here, dude. You really got some fancy stuff. Too bad I'm not a weapon user. First discovered by Alfred Nobel refers to any b damage projected by quasi-elemental plane of dynamite. What? It's fake rip point armor. An elderly gravy. 
is caused when you manage to get the pointy bit of the weapon to stick. <laughs> the other guy's flashed. <laughs> Frost brand. <laughs> Tag change is something into something else, like clean white. Oh, this is always funny to read. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have some fun with the uh, flare. See you guys next time. If you did not enjoy this video, then fuck you. I mean, uh, what was I gonna say? Something nice, presumably. This one really doesn't do anything for me. Well, that's worth a lot of money. But I can't spend it because I don't need fucking weapons. I'll keep on to that one just in case. You gotta, you gotta sometimes hold on to things, you know. You gotta make sure you got some backup, you know. You gotta get your back covered, man. You shouldn't go out there without some stuff in your back, you know. Bro. Like Brack says, buy something, will ya? I mean, goodbye, will ya?